Well, a very good morning. Thank you so much for joining in once again. Uh, my name is Melaz Milo, aka Fula. This is The Buzz UG. And uh, just in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Uh, don't forget to follow me on TikTok, uh, Melaz Milo, aka Fula. As usual, I'm going to start with the stories making headlines in the entertainment industry. Now, Clever J's concert, the return of Clever J, is happening today at Lugogo Cricket Oval. And if you can, please go and support this guy, Clever J. Yesterday, the promoters of this concert, Abitex Promotions and uh, Bajo Events, said they don't want to see the Mayanja family at the event. I believe they have their own reasons, but that's what's up from uh, that side of uh, Clever J. And of course, right here on the Buzz UG, we wish him all the best. <laughs> Now, away from that, a few months ago, there were reports in the media indicating that Dr. J. Chameleon's son, Abba, and uh, songstress Diza Luzinda's daughter, Michelle, are in a romantic relationship. However, the mother, Diza Luzinda, while speaking to the media recently at Entebbe Airport, dismissed that information and said that they are just friends and uh, right now, a romantic relationship is not necessary because they are still young kids. We live in a society where male and female can be friends, so we should embrace it and not have to create words and even to evitali or it's not necessary. They are young kids. We need to protect them. So I can't speak anything beyond that. Yeah, it would be a sort of like nga avume in that kind of direction as a parent. I can't do that. Well, another trending story in the media. A Ugandan identified as Tracy Nabukera has been crowned Miss Tanzania 2023, succeeding Halima Kope. Uh, the finale of the pageant was held at the Superdome in Masachi, Dar es Salaam, last month. Nabukera received a cash prize of 10 million and a brand new Mercedes Benz. These rewards are designed to support her in carrying out her duties within the country. Miss Tanzania 2023. The winner is Tracy. A few months ago, reports indicated that the reigning Miss Uganda, Hannah Karema Tumukunde, is a Rwandese, and Ugandans complained so big time on different social media platforms. So I don't know what they are going to say this time around after a Ugandan, Tracy Nabukera, crowned Miss Tanzania. But anyway, congratulations to you, Tracy Nabukera, right there. Now, finally, for now, change-seeking Ugandans in different parts of the world are still doing all they can to make sure that President Museveni's government falls. Recently, Ugandans living in South Africa under People Power, NUP Chapter, South Africa, delivered a petition at the U.S. Embassy highlighting the human rights violation, abandonment of rule of law, among other issues in Uganda. Their prayer is that U.S. isolates and stops funding President Museveni's government, which they called illegitimate. <laughs> Is the difference between of accepting a claim, not prosecuting her. Remember the ICC has got only one prosecutor. He's always overwhelmed. Kakati, we know who take anga you evidence in Ganyindi. But my name is not to be Seven Walia Tavana, we start from the Mokaru, which you get a wound in you. I never allow us to get it on Makomera. We have shared all that information with the embassy. We have shared the YouTube link to show facts. Well, it should be remembered that their leader, His Excellency Bobby Wine, in a recent interview made it clear that if the superpowers stop funding President Museveni's government, it will be easy for the opposition in Uganda to get rid of Museveni. But for now, it is still very, very difficult. If General Museveni was just alone using Ugandan taxpayers' money to oppress us, we would fight and win the battle even much more easily but we cannot fight against one billion u.s dollars every year that is being given to uganda 
Well, there you go. That is uh, the latest update I have for you right here on The Buzz UG. And in case you have anything on your mind about any of these stories, uh, the comment section is very open for you. But most importantly, subscribe to The Buzz UG and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. It is a bye for now. Thank you. Audio Jungle.